Welcome to the vlog. It's been so long. Your girl has not been on Instagram. Not even on Instagram. On freaking, where am I at? YouTube. I haven't been on YouTube in forever. I stopped seeing my personal achievements and just started comparison. You know, the <laughs> imposter syndrome. Mm, she is so real. Uh, so I took a step back and really decided if this was a platform that I wanted to continue to put my energy in and honestly y'all y'all show up all the time I am always at work or out and about and someone's like Renee and I'm like hey <laughs> and they're like I, I love your videos you're so inspirational you know all the things that they say in person and it's just like wow um and it's so nice when my soldiers hate hey y'all hey, Hey y'all, when they come and they're like, you know, they're asking their question, their medical question, and then they're like, oh, and girl, and I love your videos. And I just be like, it just completely breaks down this wall in me because this is something I love to do. So here we are doing a vlog. We're going to do a week in a life, I guess. Okay, come on, let's go. Guys, we are back from um, the grocery store. I want to show you guys really what I got. There's more, there's more coming, but I'm gonna go ahead and start. Dylan will just put the rest of the stuff there. Um, I get coffee in every single haul. This, I love Cafe Buesto. And then I also got these, I've tried these before. These are a triple shot of caffeine. So I went ahead and got those. Uh, lots of snacks for the kids. Dylan picked that out. I love my, I love my low sugar oatmeal. I could, I can never find like the single serve one, so I just went ahead and got that. Um, I saw that WW they're back. This is Weight Weight Watchers coming back. They have a lot of ads. A lot of influencers are doing ads with them, so I got these. But they actually really do have a lot of sugar in them. They have. 13 grams plus 9 grams added sugar, but I just went ahead and still got them. Uh, the kids love the muffins for in the morning, and they're super for on the go. These are the juices that I've been getting for years. Buy is my favorite. There is how much sugar? One gram, one gram of sugar in that, guys. So I love it, and it tastes good. So I got a couple flavors of those. We have some still in the fridge. Got some vitamin water with zero sugar, and then... Face Over Matter gets these, and I tried this. I've been wanting to try kombucha, and this is the only one that I like um, that I can actually stomach, so I get those on every trip. I am craving, craving nachos, so I went ahead and got some salsa. I do eat that on my eggs as well. Baby girl uses these on her lunch. We do pack her lunch. Dylan, you can always tell when they go to the store with me, so he got himself this, got eggs, got some chips for the kids we added to their lunches um so y'all can talk about me all y'all want but i love these rices and i'm probably like i can make regular rice but why right <laughs> so i got these for the night when we do nachos and then i got this for tonight with me and dylan we're actually gonna do a uh shrimp bowl it was gonna be a salmon bowl but the people at the fresh section weren't there they were on their break and i just i couldn't keep waiting <laughs> Got some tuna. These are my favorite, the lemon pepper. I can eat them without even judging it up. I just throw it on something and can actually like eat it. Always get the holy guacamole. Um, the, this one's actually my favorite, the chunk mini, but always, always, always make sure you check your expiration date because they be trying you, okay? 
they be trying you. <laughs> so a uh, sneak peek, I will be talking about how I prepare for my family when I am leaving for long periods of time. I'll actually be gone for 30 days. And one thing that I do is stock up on all the household things. So my husband will be doing laundry. We do laundry just about every single day. And I don't want him to run out while I'm gone. I these because these are easier. A house full of boys with a little princess. I need them to just throw one or two of them in. So instead of getting things that they have to measure out, that they can run out of, and then the kids actually do their own laundry, these are easy. They can just throw one or two in and keep it moving. The shrimp, this is the alternative to fresh salmon. And then I will be making some wings later on this week. Got some cheese. I got pears. I prefer pears over apples and pears keep you regular. <laughs> so I got a couple of those. I got some cucumbers to add to salads or to bowls. The kids love these danimals. So I got a couple of those. We're going to have nachos. Went ahead and got some toilet paper. We are a paper plates family. Like I can always tell when we don't have them and y'all like we just have too many kids to be washing dishes um i am like on this uh mushrooms kick right now i like it in my eggs i like it on pretty much everything so i went ahead and got that got some ginger root because the weather's changing and allergies is kicking everyone's butt so got this to add to tea uh tomatoes and then oh so this guys this scrub daddy is like bay okay i seen at home with kita uh, she's showing a lot of the things that she uh, lo loves to use in her home and this I absolutely love I love it love it love it so I got another one of these got some toothpaste because I'm packing myself for my trip and then also we needed some in the house and then my y'all my husband loves Noxzema he actually shaves with this I think I hate the smell of this but it is something he's used as long as i've known him and he ran out of the one he had so i went ahead and got him another yeah so i have uh some homework to do still i have laundry to put away you know i have all the things so i will show you guys our bowl that we're gonna make for dinner i probably will let dylan help or at least construct his own and then um i'm checking with you guys tomorrow tomorrow's monday monday's always fun at work so i don't know if it's going to be a week in a life or a few days in a life but we back Yes, Mama. You can't what? You can't what, dude? A cat? Oh, 
Alright guys, I apologize for the angle. It is super weird. Um, and I'm in baby girl's room. This is not her closet. That's just like some extra stuff that we just don't use, need to give away, whatever. Um, but I am making my list. So I got this hat from the Maddie James when she travels. Oh, that light. When she travels with her family, they always make a list of just everything. It keeps me so organized. It's a running list. So if I think of something else that I need, then I'll just throw it on the list. And as I put things in my bag, I um, scratch them off. So catch you guys up. I'm actually leaving for about 30 days. Um, and I'm flying out. I'm going away from military training and I just have a lot of military things to take. I have regular things to take. Oh, let me add that. Let's see. Business casual. So I'm just sharing like a, a couple hacks that I do, um, when I'm gone. So the first thing I do when I'm packing, um, and then while I'm actually gone, I will share with you like how I take care of my family while I'm gone, how I prepare my family, all those things. I have a video and I'll go ahead and link it in the cards, uh, but I've never gone away for this long. So this, this process is a little bit different. So it's in the middle of the day because this is a work uh, trip. I do have time during work to prepare for it. And there's a lot of preparation that's needed to be done. Like I'm the mom. So I have to make sure my husband's good, make sure I'm good, make sure everything is good. Like failure still is an option, even though I'm the mom. So I have my list. It has things like, you know, categories like workout clothes, lounge clothes. And then it has like everything like bra, deodorant, lotion, you know, sanitizing pr products, um, headphones. So everything that I could possibly think of, I'm going to put on here. And then as I put them in the bag, I will, I scratch them off. So I, do, I make sure I don't forget anything. Second thing I do, let me get comfortable. Not comfortable. And I have a meeting in like 45 minutes. So I need to like get going, right? Uh, second thing I do is actually use full size products. So I'm going to be really quick and show you some of the full size products that I'm taking. I will be gone. If I'm gone for over a week, I will go ahead and purchase full size products of the things that I use. So that way I'm comfortable. I don't have to worry about running out. I can know that the things that I'm taking, I'm going to love. My body's going to love. I'm not really switching anything out while I'm gone. And I'm not going to run out, right? I can just do my normal process. I do take things that I love. I don't try anything new when I travel. It's just, I just don't recommend it. And then, so even though everything is going to go in these bags, I do like take like, this bag is nasty, but I do like put things that could spill, even though they're brand new, break or anything like in a separate compartment. This is just a regular like bag, like tote bag. Um, just so if I do have like a hazard, it's all good. So, things that I'm taking. These are body wipes because we will be going to the field for a few days. If I get stinky, nasty, whatnot, I have them. Uh, I got this from the Sephora sale. You guys saw it on the reel. It's just perfume. I love to smell good. I love Burberry Her. So, just got that. The Atula Skincare, the uh, Cults Classic. This is my absolute favorite cleanser i just finished the one that i was using and this one will be what i'm taking on my trip fenty skin this is the butter drop the body uh moisturizer y'all i love this stuff like this is probably my second or third one we have the so the Hanetto. this is the yellow one anita so i'm taking this i'm also taking this is not brand new i've opened it but it's from last um summer uh the spf the patrick ta this is uh this is from a, a couple summers ago maybe last summer but the body oil the little shimmer this is from when i go out with the kids or if i just take some photos i have the bread this is the macadamia oil this is for hair and body i really do love bread only thing i don't like is the last one i had i dropped it and it broke unseen screen this is my sunscreen 
I love the Living Proof for having these like trial size that are this big. So this is Curl Definer and Restorative Mask. Your belt? No. It might be in your um, nightstand, babe. All right. So that's all that I already have in here. I'm going to leave it open because I, um, I'm going to continue to put stuff in there. But like my makeup, I'll put in there. But those are things that I have in there right now. These items um, are like household items that I'm taking with me. Um, and I'm just going like, to lay them in here. So I have tithe and I have snuggle because I'll be there for 30 days. So I will be doing my laundry. Doing my laundry actually helps to um, not have to pack so much, right? So I'm taking these big bags, but I really won't be packing so much because I'm able to wash my clothes. So I have those. I also have some bounty. So things that I use at home, things I know I love, things that I know won't break me out or give me any issues. Taking some Lysol wipes because I wipe down my room. I do. I wipe down my room. So I got these that are going to hit like in this big suitcase. One side is going to be all the wet things, personal hygiene, um, household things like the things that keep me sane. The other side would be clothes. I'm not taking that many clothes because it's mostly lounge wear, workout wear, work clothes, um, which will go into my military bag outside of one uniform and um, like one like one or two sets that I can go out about and about with. I will be taking like additional shirts and some things to make content with, but it's all going to fit. So these wet wipes um, are actually going to go in my carry-on, like personal bags I'm taking on the plane because I do wipe off the plane. I have uh, these Snuggle fragrance diffusers. They look really cute, but I thought this would be really good for just keeping the room clean, keeping it smelling good because I'll be there for an extended period of time. I have Dove and this I will actually put in here with all this wet stuff. Uh, just a full brand new thing of Dove. I have deodorant. Um, this is the Degree, which I love Degree, Calming Lavender, but this is aluminum and alcohol free. I try. I try to do aluminum free if possible. And then I have this. This will definitely go into the bag because um, like things expand. I probably really shouldn't even travel with the aerosol can, but I think it'll be fine because they uh, neutralize the plane. So aerosol can this is nutra air my phone's about to die um this is deodorizing and disinfect so i got this i'm just gonna put this in this bag okay. i showed you guys this so those are all the things that i have right now i am gonna start scratch uh, scratching some things off on here so i can scratch off cleaning and sanitizing lotion deodorant i need to put pads tampons liners in here i can scratch off skincare because i think i have everything i need for my skincare hair care is still questionable because i don't know what i need for my braids i need like ponytail holders and things of that nature perfume i can scratch off body wash i can scratch off okay that's it my own pillowcases this time. I'm going to be gone for such a long period of time that I think it'll be good for me to actually take my own pillow uh, case. And I'm going to take a throw. Right, I'm going to check in with y'all later. I have a meeting in like 30 minutes. I'm going to throw some more stuff in here, get myself together, and then move on. Right? Move on. So let's go 
Thank you so much. Please like and subscribe. Join the internet family. I'm going to put on some lip gloss for you guys. This is the Army Princess collection because I look crazy. Okay? Let me see. This is one of her new shades. Um, oh, no. It's Commando. Which is not a new shade. Um, but I'm going to pop a little bit of. This is G.I. Jane. A little of this in the center. All right. So I look crazy. Hopefully you guys cannot hear the AC, but it's it's hot. Um, I was supposed to get my hair braided today, and she couldn't grip it. So the great debate. I'm just gonna cut it down the sides down a little bit if I'm gonna go back and try to get false locks, which I don't really know what the like the military. <laughs> Or if I am going to just suck it up and um, leave my hair as is. Uh, I went to Target. We need a microwave. So my husband put a microwave, the microwave that was in our house, in the shop. And now we don't have a microwave. So I had to come get a microwave. Online it was $20 cheaper. So I ordered it online. Had to wait two hours. Uh, so I actually was already like shopping around. I'm gonna do a really, really super duper quick haul and then we're gonna end the vlog. So if you guys have read the latest uh, blog post, I talk about how I am just like bougie on a budget, able to uh, save money while doing, you know, certain things for my family, for myself. And one thing is shopping the clearance rack. So every store, every end of the season, they have a clearance sale, like huge clearance, trying to get rid of inventory to get new inventory in, to make space. And I always shop the clearance rack. So I got a lot of stuff for everyone in my family, besides myself. I didn't get myself anything. I didn't even go to the women's clearance rack because I just, I just don't, I just don't need anything. I also got some stuff from my friend's wedding. I will show you guys more of that and put it out but that video won't even be out until after her bridal shower but the back of the car is full of things that are from hobby lobby but I'll show you guys really quick so i got this the light the light won't even let me be great let me do a okay um nope nope i just hold up all right so I got this for my husband. It is like a, I don't even know what kind of neck this is called for men, but this was $14.99. It was 30 bucks before, so half off, but super cute. Um, you know, he's a grown man and he doesn't, like his body doesn't change really. So I got that for him um, to put in his closet. He can wear it, whatever. And actually it's like in the 80s, 70s, 80s this week, but next week it's going back to the 50s. So he can probably still get wear out of it this season. Then I got two uh, press on nails for myself. I really want to try these. I love getting my nails done. Don't like the process. Don't like the cost. So these were seven and eight bucks. Um, so I'm going to try them. I'm going to put these on. We actually have an event tomorrow so i'm gonna put these on see if these are these are probably a little bit too long but i probably can wear these at work so so i got this um zip up jacket my kids they're teenagers preteens. they wear freaking hoodies and stuff all year long so i just got this little hoodie zip up uh jacket for dylan this is eight dollars i think it was normally like 20 bucks because dylan wears an adult medium so this was $8.99. It was normally $30, y'all. Crazy. Also got um Andre wears an extra small in mid. These were at $7.49. So these are shorts for Dylan. These are like 
these were six dollars and they're just some um, basketball shorts for Dylan for baby girl so her shirts were five dollars I do prefer Walmart but um, these are cute and I need some shirts for her because I'm packing the bag to go uh, with her while she travels while I'm gone and then also to stay home with dad so I got her this it says hearts daddy I got my husband some underwear because all the time I got this for Tay Tay I'm always looking for a bonnet for her that will stay on her head so this is actually a kid's bonnet that's not really small she has a lot of hair and you can kind of um, tie it so we'll see how this goes now, I will be in the hotel for 30 days, so I got myself some slippers. I don't typically wear slippers at home, but these, you know, were all the rage maybe two summers ago. So I went ahead and got some of these for myself. And then this is just a shirt. Y'all, this shirt was $2.99 for Dylan. Men's small. I mean, men's medium. And then another shirt for Tay Tay. husband's gonna be like girl uh. i got this for um our 18 year old it's super cute it's like it's got a hood on it but it's like a um what is this like corduroy type of jacket um super cute definitely his swag and this was nine nine bucks and i got this cute shirt i have a i got a bunch of these for the kids so it's just purple and green and this was three dollars and then another shirt for Tay Tay. Tay Tay got a bunch of stuff, but she always gets a bunch of stuff. So that's nothing new. So for baby girl, like I said, it's hot right now, but it's going to get cold again. And she doesn't really have too many jackets. So I just got her this cute little um, zip up hoodie. And then this dress was $5. Um, so long sleeve things, I do size up. So I got 4T in these, but I did get a 3T one because again, it's still gonna be a few cold days. Um, so this one's 3T. I, look, y'all, these Christmas pajamas right here, $4. I said, let me get that. Just size up, super soft. I will put them in her closet um, and she can wear them next year. But these were $4. And I said, yep, yep, let me get that. So I got this for baby girl. Um, this is a Dr. Terrell's bath. It's the sleeping one. It has a little tiny, a little tiny bit of melatonin, but it just helps relax her, get her ready for bedtime. I did get these for um, my friend's bridal shower. So a lot is going into that, but um, I'm just gonna do in vinyl bride and groom on here. So that way this can be what they can drink out of that day. And then they can have it in their home. Um, and maybe have like their wedding dates on it um i got these for tay tay let's get her ready for the summertime now we had these last year and they were a little bit hard for her to walk in she just has really 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 skinny feet uh but i just went ahead and got her these again we're gonna try it again she's a little bit older this year i think i have one more bag and then i'm gonna see if my microwave is ready i probably could have asked them in the store if they could have just went and grabbed it for me, but I was just like, oh, no. Y'all, so these I got for Octavia Renee. These are $4. Nope, they were $5.99. These are $20 boots. These are her size this year, but she actually, these are eights. She wears a seven and these are eight, so she can wear these next season, but her feet grow so small that she probably will be able to wear, wear these. I got these for the summer this year. I love these. I pretty much get these every year for her. Um, so they just have holes in them and they're plastic so she can walk like normal she can play in them she can go to the park in them but they have like little holes to let her feet breathe and then that's it oh and another pair of um, leggings for her so guys that is it I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog um, I got a lot of stuff on here and then my next video I'm gonna talk to you guys a lot more about what I have done to prepare for my family uh, before I leave and then while I'm actually gone thank you guys so much for watching please like and subscribe more vlogs more sit down videos more all the things are coming up I know I've been MIA for quite a while so if you have gotten this far please 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 join the family subscribe and hopefully Next time y'all see me, I have a different hairstyle too because I'm struggling.